plan to have children in the future? Okay, so I love kids, but I never imagined or planned to have a, a baby at such a young age. So I'm a teen mom, and I have a two-year-old son, and his name is Nicholas. And I have only been a mom for two years, but I can confidently say that I love it, and I enjoy every moment of it. Um, I'm going to be talking about the motherhood culture. So that's my baby. Um, he represents strength to me. Sorry, I'm really nervous. He represents strength to me because by looking at this picture, I remember the day he was born. And um, it just, he's the reason I move forward. Like, he makes me not want to give up in life. So by listening to my experiences, I hope you guys get an understanding of what the motherhood culture consists of. So first I'll be talking about what it's like to be a mom from my perspective, and then I'll talk about how having a baby changed my life and my life decisions. Um, so as a teen mom, well I'm a single teen mom, so it's kind of hard for me to um, juggle work, school, and uh, being a mom all at the same time. It's just, it gets difficult. But I. I just, I love it. Like, I know it gets hard at times, but I feel like in the end, I'm gonna be happy with what I've done. Um, having a baby makes me think twice about decisions that I have to make. For example, if I wanted to take a break from school, I know I can't because I have to build a good future for me and my son. Um, also, like, if I wanna be out late at night, obviously I can't because my baby can get sick or he gets tired and sleepy. So I have to think about him before I make a decision. Um, well, he represents, like I said, strength for me. Um, when I feel sad or when I feel like giving up, when I feel like I can't accomplish something, I look at this picture, because of the day he was born. And um, I just think, like, I have to do this for him. I have to do this for our future. I identify with this because well, I'm a mom. And, um, like other moms, I can connect with them, like, like say, when they have to stay up all night. Like, for example, one time, my baby was crying and crying, and I couldn't figure out why. So um, I took him to the ER, and he had an ear infection. So that night, I had to stay up all night, you know, taking care of him. Um, but on the bright side, I also have the pleasure to enjoy every moment of his life. Like, uh, when he took his first walk, or when he crawled first, um, and uh, yeah, just all the great moments and watching him grow and you know do the things he does is amazing. Um, so as you guys can tell, motherhood consists of responsibilities and having to play. As he grows, I'm gonna have to play the role of a teacher, a friend, you know, a mom. So I love being a mother, um, and I know it's gonna get difficult at times. And I'm gonna feel stuck or, you know, sometimes feel like I'm a failure, but, you know, I guess I'll get through it. Um, but I wouldn't wanna have it any other way, you know. So, for you girls who wanna have kids, I know you guys are gonna be great moms. And for you guys, just always try to understand what a mom goes through.